Ritak Sangol is located on the southwest coast of Penang Island. It is a fishing village famously known for its beautiful beaches. We can also see some pig farms in that area, including Penang's largest pig farm. The pig farm is operated by Mr. Nine, helped by five of his workers from Vietnam. Every morning, the workers start their daily routine by feeding the pigs with corns and soybean meal. They go around the pig pens with their pills filled with food. The pigs get water from the pipe by pressing the button with their noses. Pigs require water for most metabolic functions, adjustment of body temperature, movement of nutrients into the body tissue, removal of metabolic waste, production of milk and for growth and reproduction. To maintain the standard of hygiene, the workers bathe the pigs and they clean the pans twice a day. However, Waste smell remains a problem which is difficult to manage. To produce better quality of food, the owner gets the imported corns from US. Each collection can be inseminated into 15 female pigs called soul. The corns are minced into powder form by using the machines before blending with the soy and wheat. The mixture is then added with some vitamins and mineral to balance the diet. After producing the meal, the workers keep them into packets. In the farm, the farmer does artificial insemination in order to increase productivity. A boar must be at least 8 months old for breeding. The farmer collects the sperm by stimulating the boar's genital and the sperm collected will be taken into the office for fermentation. The collection of sperm will be handled carefully by the farmer. Each collection can be inseminated into 15 female pigs called soul. In the beginning of the process, the farmer will examine the sperm under a microscope as the liquid has to be in an active status to be added with some glucose.
This is to extend the lifespan of the sperm and also to maintain good quality. The mixture will be then packed and stored in the refrigerator at a very low temperature. Each collection can be inseminated into 15 female pigs called souls. Souls that are selected for breeding are at least 5 to 6 months old. The pigs that are not selected can be sold at the weight of 85 to 90 kilograms. The souls are kept in crates during pregnancy. Each pregnancy lasts for about 3 months or an average of 114 days. If there is a difficulty in delivering the babies, a worker will dig the baby out with his bare hands. เสร็จเนี่ยเนาะบ่ใส่แก้วเนาะบ่ใส่แก้วเนาะบ่ดอกฮ่องปั้มที่ปี <coughs> ไม่เสียชื่อสีไอ้กายชื่อกี้กายเว้ยไอ้ชื่อสีแรกเสียไอ้กายชื่อกี้ลูกหมูกายชื่อกี้อิหม่าไม่ห่วยเจียอะไร
dia tak apa kau lah ini lam pam mai oi ubi ya dia ti itu han dulu boko aji pen tuko ya i tuko sana bolang ai ya kan dah lai lam pam dah dekat dia The average lifespan of a pig is about 7 to 8 years. A pig in farm can only live for 6 months. When the pig reach 100 kilograms and above, they will then sell to the slaughter. The pig will first be chased into a cage which is a weighing skills. The pigs are deal based on their weight. The workers will use a tool which is made by a wooden piece with a nail to step on the pig and to chase them into the log. During the weighing process, Mr. Nai will inject some anesthesia on the pig so that the pig will faint later on the lorry and this is the slogging process. Every 12 o'clock in the afternoon, a lorry will come and get the pigs. More than 10 pigs are sold each day. never know how tough and challenging it is to manage a pig farm. As we can see, the hardship and sweats these workers have to go through is indescribable and unbelievable. <laughs>